Hello families, welcome to today's activity, racing at the preschool raceway. For this activity, you'll need the small toy car that was included in your materials activity kit for the week. And also something to make a ramp to roll your car down and something to prop that ramp up. I'm using a long piece of cardboard and a shoe box. You could also use things like uh, plastic tote lids, cookie sheets, large books, um, paper tubes, clipboards, anything that's large enough to roll a car down. So in this activity, we're going to be scientists by making predictions and experimenting to test our ideas out. Every experiment starts with a question, and our question is today, what do you, th what do you predict will happen when we put this car at the top of the ramp? And remember, a prediction is when you say something that you think will happen. Let's make our predictions. I predict that when I put my car at the top of the ramp, it's gonna roll down. Maybe fast, I don't know. Let's test out that idea by experimenting. All right, are you ready for the first experiment? Let's see what happens. Whoa, what happened? It rolled down the ramp, it did. It didn't go really fast though. It kind of went medium speed, not fast, but not slow. Hmm, what do you think made it go that speed? It looks like part of my prediction was correct. I predicted that if I put it on the top of the ramp, that it would roll down, but I thought it was gonna go fast, but it kind of just went medium. Hmm, that leads us to our next question. How do you think we can make it go even faster? I remember a while back seeing balls rolling down the slide at the playground. And when we put the balls towards the bottom of the slide where it wasn't very high, the balls didn't roll fast. But I remember when we put the balls up high at the top of the slide, they rolled really fast. Just now, my ramp isn't that high, so it didn't go very fast. I'm predicting that maybe if we move this end of the ramp up higher and taller like the tall side, I'm predicting that it might make my car go faster. Let's experiment and test it out. All right, guys, so I raised up the incline of our ramp, so now it's more steep like the slide. So let's test it out. Remember, we predicted that it would go faster. Let's see what happens. Are you ready? Whoa, did you see that? Oh my goodness. It did go faster, our prediction was correct. The taller the ramp and the higher the slope, the faster it went. So now I wonder what your next predictions will be and what different kinds of ramps you might build. Show us and tell us about your raceways. What kinds of, what kinds of predictions did you make? And what happened when you experimented? Was it what you expected or did something different happen? And why do you think it happened that way? So while you're racing cars at home with your preschooler, you can comment on how they're using the materials, how they're making the ramps and what they're doing with them. You can ask them to describe what's happening and also to explain their thinking by asking them questions like, why do you think that happened that way? When you try out this activity with your preschooler, you can extend it by trying out different kinds of materials of different lengths and sizes to use as a ramp. You can experiment with different heights to use as inclines for the ramp. Also try starting your race out in different spots on the ramp from the top to the bottom and see how it happens differently. If you have extra things to roll down the ramp like balls, extra cars, toilet paper tubes, maybe roll them side by side and have a race. You can also use measuring tapes and rulers to mark and measure distance. You could also use a stopwatch or the timer on your cell phone to measure the length of time that the material rolls. To send us your results, you can send us notes, pictures, and videos via email, and also send us your results through the Core Advantage Family Portal. We can't wait to hear from you. Until next time, bye.